Thank you, Take Charge. I decided to come because I like to take on leadership roles and I think it was important to come along today to find um, better ways I can make a positive impact in other people's lives. I think that's what being a leader is, helping out others and making an impact. Today's been like a good opportunity for us to learn about uh, leadership roles and like different opportunities in which we can lead our community. It spreads awareness that young people can take charge and can make a difference. We've got 120 students here today from 15 high schools across the region and that was, that's just fabulous. The Take Charge Forum um, is aiming to bring together young people from 12 to 18 years of age. They're going to workshops on how to become Prime Minister, how to use social media, how to use the traditional media to further their causes. So it's aiming to um, you know, promote leadership, help them take leadership roles and also offer them the opportunity to see themselves in the context of a region rather than just the town they live in. Especially lately after hearing all the time that social media is dangerous and uh, you should be careful, it's good to hear that it can be used for positive and good changes and seeing different case studies in ways that it was used to uh, benefit communities and help others, I think that's a great and amazing thing. I've brought along seven of my Year 11 um, students, I'm their Year Coordinator and I thought it was a great opportunity for them to come and see a forum that was based on leadership as they'll be becoming our senior students, our Year 12 students uh, next year, so they'll be the leaders of our school. Whenever I'm out there having a go, I am a success. My goal will be realised because I am taking action and it is a worthy ideal. I got invited to speak about my, my charity and, and my kids to kids stuff. I just started it at 12, and, but it just snowballed from there. Since then I've raised over $50,000 for various projects under kids to kids and it's just been fantastic and it's just opened up a world of opportunity and you know, it, I want to encourage kids, even if it's not charity work, just to follow their passion and just to get the most out of life. Go and follow your passion, follow your dreams. If you have something in your gut that you want to do, follow it. Don't let anyone ever tell you that you can't or you won't. You are the master of your own destiny. Today I spoke about, I guess, realising that potential and having, I guess, having the guts to go out there and fight for what you want and really go and fight for your dreams with all the passion that you have. I think different people will take away different things. For some it might be a bit of a personal journey and a personal realisation about what they want to do when they get older, perhaps throwing themselves more into some charity work. For others it might just be going out with the confidence to be able to speak to new people in new situations and really just um, maybe confirming some of the ideas and dreams that they had in the first place. Are you ready to start a hip hop workshop? Are you ready to get this party started? Yeah! Basically, I'm just going to teach them three routines that they'll have fun with and hopefully do a massive routine to it at the end of the day. I hope they go off with, that, um, with some cool moves and a smile on their face after a workshop with me. I liked how he used a different style that you don't normally use, like the hip hop style. It was really good. I think everyone went well. I didn't get the dance moves, but it's, <laughs> that's all right. Accept every opportunity that you can, you know, just to open up doors and, yeah, it's, it's awesome. It, it's a whole different world. Make you feel where this phone came from I can make you
Yeah. 